Hello everyone, this is TechBizmo, and welcome back once again to another video. Um, today I thought, uh, why not, let's take a look at the Light DM greeter settings. So if you guys do not know what the Light DM um, display manager is, it's basically the program that allows for all of this uh, GUI stuff going on. So uh, you can see the menu here, this is all Light DM. Um, this window right here is also Light DM. Um, yeah, so I thought let's go ahead and check out the lock screen manager for Light DM because uh, this is included with many Linux distributions. Uh, in this case, I will be using Zubuntu Linux um, because that's the distro I'm currently running, of course. Um, so yeah, uh, once you open Light DM GTK Plus Greeter settings, um, this is the uh, window that you'll be greeted by. It's just a small little window here, um, and so. Um, yeah, you can use this, of course, to customize your lock screen, um, well, your login screen slash lock screen thing. <laughs> um, you can see we've got some theme settings, we've got some icon settings, font settings, uh, you know, all that sort of stuff. Uh, we've got um, our icon image, so our user image, so I could go ahead and choose a, you know, my own uh, personal image. If I look on my computer, of course, I've got to go all the way to home, TechBizmo, pictures, and there we have it. There is my TechBizmo logo. You guys can see right there. And if I want to save the changes, I just go ahead and click save. Um, so yeah, that is how you, of course, add a little, your own little avatar. Um, but this is just, you know, a video dedicated to exploring this program. So I'm not just going to show you guys how to do that. Let's go ahead and ch change the theme. So uh, why not? Let's go ahead and lock the screen right now. You guys can see, currently I believe it requires a restart for the uh, icon to show up. Um, currently we've got this theme set up here. I might have to do some, you know, um, reboots uh, in between this, in between recording this video to uh, show you guys what settings I've changed. Uh, but anyways, let's go ahead and type my password back in. Um, so yeah, uh, you guys saw the theme there. We can go ahead and change it from uh, Apparently that theme name was is Graybird, so that's what it is set on by default in XFC or well in Zubuntu. I apologize, <clears throat> or XFC. I'm not sure. Um, so for theme, why not? Um, since New Mix is my absolute favorite, it's been my absolute favorite for about two and a half years now. <laughs> uh, we'll go ahead and select New Mix as well as the icon theme. We'll go ahead and make that New Mix circle, and. Uh, Go ahead and save the changes and have a look, see if that changed anything. I don't know if it has changed anything now due to the fact that um, I did not reboot the computer, so we'll come back after a little reboot. Well guys, unfortunately it seems I'm unable to log out and show you guys my current theming on uh, my uh, login manager, so uh, I apologize for any inconvenience. Um, but we will go ahead and just uh, proceed in this video. I will try my best to explain and describe what uh, all this these settings change and what they did change in my uh, GTK um, login window. Well, anyways, uh, yeah, here we are back in the program. I, I, I actually did try to log out, but that unfortunately did not work. It, uh, it of course, <clears throat> just stopped recording the screen once I, you know, pretty much immediately after I logged out. So hopefully sometime I'll get a, you know, a capture card or something to record my screens and I'll be able to show you guys everything. Well, anyways, let's go ahead and proceed in showing you guys this software. So of course the theme, this will change, you know, your, uh, the actual uh, GTK theming of the, uh, the, the manager, the login manager. Um, so this will change like your top bar appearance, your, uh, um, login, uh, what's it called, login window appearance, um, that sort of stuff. Icons won't really show unless, you know, you have a notification or something in the corner. Um, so Numix circle icons won't really show up very well. Um, so, you know, I'm going to leave that on Numix circle anyways because I have seen it in the past and it does look pretty good, you know, when I have a notification or something from one of these programs, you know, it shows the lovely Numix circle um, icon. Uh, then font, obviously, this uh, you can change the font that's all around your login screen, your login manager. 
And then for the background image, this, uh, of course, you can choose whatever the heck you want. Um, so I could just choose any of these pictures here, um, as well as I could go through my own um, my own file system and pick my own picture. However, I'm not going to be doing that because there's no way I can show, show you guys at the moment. Um, and then the user image, um, this one actually did, uh, I was able to get a look at this when I rebooted my computer earlier. Um, I was able to see that it did change my icon to the signature Techbizmo logo, so that was very, very nice. Um, and of course, actually here, something I did not go over, you can choose color, a solid color, um, as opposed to a um, chosen image. So, But for now, we're going to leave it on image because I prefer the images as opposed to solid colors because they just look a little bit prettier. <clears throat> and also, here's this little box that you can choose to use the, um, the user wallpaper. So it'll be whatever this wallpaper is um, at that current moment. It'll um, move it over to the lock screen, and then that uh, your current desktop wallpaper will be your lock screen wallpaper, which... Yeah, we'll keep it because I I like this wallpaper. Sure, it's a default one, but it's it's pretty dandy. <laughs> uh, for the panels, so this is the top bar at the top that you guys will see on the uh, GTK greeter, the Light DM greeter. So obviously, my host name is Techbizmo. Um, yeah, this is just like a regular um, XFCE panel. You know, you've got all sort of settings, all sorts of settings. So I could uh, you know change the type of clock it is. Um, I could add some spacers. I could add other things, um, which I don't know. I think that's pretty cool for just a lock screen manager. <laughs> Got a power menu as well. Uh, yeah, that's enough looking at that. Window positions. This is this will be where you're, you know, you type your password wherever that window position, wherever that window will be. So I usually like to just keep it in the middle, but uh, occasionally I'll get bored of it and say, hey, let's do it on the side. <laughs> Um, but we're going to leave that in center. Um, and then, yeah, you can, of course, resize your um, your login um, area, your login screen, your login window. Um, yeah, I just think that's pretty cool. Especially since this is just, you know, talking about your lock screen. XFCE is a really cool desktop environment. Um, you know, if you're talking about display managers and the actual desktop environment itself, because... XSC is very customizable, and I love it. Yeah. Um, yeah, so enough about that. Here's miscellaneous stuff. So, um, you know, you've got a touchscreen keyboard because I've got a touch touchscreen display. This is me using the touchscreen right now. Um, although I don't really use the touchscreen very often on Linux because, as you guys know, uh, touchscreen support on XSE really isn't that good. <laughs> Anyways... Um, yeah, so for the, the keyboard, um, the touchscreen keyboard that it has is called Onboard. Um, that is my favorite Linux uh, touchscreen keyboard program. Works very, very well. So I will just leave it there since it comes in handy. And then Reader, I believe this, I believe Reader is like an actual, um, it'll actually narrate everything that you're, you know, everything you hover over. Um, but I could be wrong. Go ahead and correct me in the comments section if you guys know I'm incorrect. Um, contrast theme, you know, I could change, what is that, I believe, contrast theme, hmm, I believe that means like, uh, during different stages of you being logged in, like say you just locked your computer instead of completely logging out, you know, the it could do a different theme. But anyways, we'll just leave that as that. We'll not touch it for now. Uh, large fonts, yeah, apparently you can enable that at start. See, I think that's when you first start your computer, it could show a different font um, as when you just lock, as opposed to when you just lock your computer, the font could be, I don't know, different. But that's really unimportant, so we'll just go ahead and uh, leave that alone for now. Well, anyways, guys, um, that is pretty much it. That is a uh, that is the Light DM GTK Plus greeter greeter settings that is included with um, Zubuntu Linux, and I believe many many other um, XFC desktop environment distros, any other Linux distributions that um, consist of the XFC four desktop environment. They usually um, 
consist of also um, the LightDM um, login manager. <clears throat> well, anyways, guys, as I said, it has come towards the end of this video now. We'll go ahead and close that program out, as well as this window here. <laughs> as I said, guys, it's the end of this video now. Thank you guys very, very much for watching this video. Please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and uh, be sure to check out some of my other videos. That is youtube.com slash techgizmo. Merry Christmas, guys.